was last year when I decided to uh, push the industrial hemp bill, which I thought was a good idea, uh, majority of House members thought I was crazy. They may have thought the same thing about conservative Republican Rep. Jay Reedy when he grew industrial hemp on his Middle Tennessee farm. If I'm that passionate about it, then I need to do something to educate myself about it. He tells skeptical colleagues that industrial hemp is not marijuana, but they had fears. He said, hey, Reedy, uh, we're worried about your political career, and I said, well, I'm not here for a career. I'm here to do what's right. What he saw as right about industrial hemp drew concern from law enforcement and state health officials about the levels of THC, the ingredient in the plant that gets you high, they asked. But Reedy passed a bill keeping levels at 0.3%. The bill also allowed for research at Tennessee State Colleges and paved the way for much more growth of industrial hemp in Tennessee. But it's amazing how many different hemp companies across the country want to come to Tennessee now because we've relaxed the laws. The lawmaker could not help but highlight the many varied uses of hemp with this t-shirt. Of course, it's campaign season for, for all the House members, so I found out that there was actually a company that made t-shirts out of hemp fiber. Many other uses of hemp are seen this week at a TSU seminar and an expo in Nashville. Reporting from the state capitol, Chris Bungart.